Yo, what's up, Foresters? I am Little Gamer, and welcome back to the Vegan Challenge episode number three. Um, uh, now, I'm just going to um, go around and pick up these uh, cone flower just here. Um, last episode we finished off here, I just built a temporary shelter so I could save, um, as I always do. Let's pick these cone flower up. And Right, so this episode we are going to go and get the flare gun. Uh, we're also going to need the key card in order to um, go down into our cave system uh, to get to the laboratory to save little Timmy. So let's just head down here, uh, stock up on plants uh, so that we can make some energy mixes. Yes, I do. Yeah, so we can make some energy mixes, some health mixes, um, and also I noticed. Let's have a look at our stats. Yeah, I'm infected. So let's eat one of those aloes. That will help. There you go. No longer infected. So let's just pop over here. It looks like it's um, just about to become night time. So what I'll probably do... Oh, there's aloe there. Any more around? Normally where you find one, there'll be a couple. So just have some blueberries here. We'll eat them. I know we're full on. Full now, some chicory, more blueberries. Blueberry seeds collected. Uh, so you can plant um, a lot of these berries and stuff. See these white ones here, these are poisonous, you don't want to be eating them. Um, the white ones and then the the red the red ones with the uh, little black middle are also poisonous. Um, right, so there's aloe just down here. I think there should be four around here somewhere. Yeah, one there. Let's get our light right. It's getting dark, so, so you can see. One there, one there. Should be one more somewhere. There it is. Right, I'll head over here. Grab some more marigolds. And then what I'm going to do now, I wouldn't normally um, sleep. Uh, because on day six the mutants come out, we're still only on day one. Um, so just for recording purposes, I am going to sleep um, so that we're not sort of travelling through the night time. Uh, make it a little bit easier for you guys to see. Uh, so there's a good place. Let's find somewhere where there's quite a few sticks for us. I'll tell you what, we'll just head back up here and sleep in our temporary shelter, shall we? Because, um, yeah, that'll destroy it. Yeah, there it is up there. Look, if you look for your little home. Let's head up there. We can um, we can sleep. Uh, lots of animals around here. If you're, um, if you're looking for somewhere to build, um, I highly recommend this place. I've, I've done a couple of builds up here with friends on multiplayers, that kind of thing. Also on solos as well. Um, it's it's not very patrolled that much by the cannibals. Um, after day six, you might get a few mutants that patrol over that side of the island. Um, and I built up there once, and they sort of just walked by. And if I was out, you know, gathering resources, and they saw me, they'd attack me. But otherwise, they'd just sort of stroll on by. As long as you don't bother them, they won't bother you. Uh, so yeah, here we are, back at our shelter. See what let's make some so aloe cone flour and chicory I think it is. Is that energy mix plus? Yeah. So aloe cone flour chicory and then we'll make some more health mix plus which is aloe cone flour I believe. Is that, is that it? 
Come on, tell me, tell me, tell me. Yeah, health mix plus. So, marigold, aloe, coneflower. That's our last bit of coneflower there. Um, hopefully, if we sleep, uh, when we wake up, there might be some more coneflower around here. That'd be a result, wouldn't it? All right, so let's sleep here. There we are. Good morning. <laughs> no, there's no coneflower. All right, so um, I'll just show you exactly where we are. Oh, there's one there. Any more spawning in? No. No? Okay, okay. I'll just show you where we're heading to. So if you go up high, you see the mountain there right in front of me? Let's put the lighter away. That is the north facing mountain. So anywhere you're in the game, if you look look directly at that, you'll be looking north. So north's that way. And the plane is just sort of to the right of it. Um, anyway, I'll, um, I'll show you exactly where it is we're going. So I'll see you when we get to the plane. Okay guys, so here we are, this is what you're looking for, uh, as your north facing mountain there, and this slope just here to the right, let's pop our snowshoes on, uh, walk faster in the snow, yeah that'll do, very fashionable, look at them bad boys, <laughs> oh, right, <let's laughs> oh look, as soon as you go into the snow, that's it, you just get cold, um, so once you go up that first little ramp, you want to head to the right, Should be just over here. Right, let's show you what it is we're looking for. No, have I? I've come up a different different slope so I think it's to the left there then oh, I made another boo boo look and we're getting cold now oh, where's this plane where's this cockpit there it is over there that you see it just spawned in just there if you look to the the two trees that are together uh, the one on the right is just below it so there's your cockpit, and uh, that's your location for your flare gun. So we'll head over there and obtain the flare gun. Uh, it's a great weapon for killing the, the boss at the end, and, and like if you're just playing the game normally, it's, it's good for killing mutants and cannibals as well. Also, if you're not a vegan, unlike me, if you shoot. Uh, deer or boar with it, pretty much kills them instantly. The rabbits are a little bit hard to shoot them because they're, they're smaller, but yeah, you, you're better off just hitting the rabbits with a you know, as you're um, so. Look at that, look, I'm a pilot now. Yes, I know you're cold, mate, I know you're cold. I would be as well. Let's light it up to warm him up. There's your flare gun, look. We'll take that as a story on TV star's wife dies. I'm a TV star! Uh, so, 
poor little Timmy, his mum's just died and now he's been kidnapped by cannibals. Crashed, plane crash that he was on. He's not having much luck, little Timmy, is he? Bless him. No fancy being little Timmy. Anyway, have no fear, Timmy. We're coming to save you. Right, so now I'm going to head over to the uh, key card. Um, if you remember back in episode one, we marked it up with a yellow flag. So I'll head over to the yellow flag and I'll, um, I'll see you guys when I get there. So here we are, we're back at the yellow flag. This is the entrance for the key card. So let's head on in here. And we'll take our lighter out. And now let's sort our quick slots out because we've now got a flare gun. If you put, put all your flares, just flares, <laughs> just take that away, take that away, take them away. Put your flares and then your flare gun into your combination hit the cogwheel and they'll be in your flare gun so there was five before there's 15 there now because you can only carry 10 flares so when we get another 10 we'll pop them into the flare gun so what we'll do is we should pop that into um, let's pop that into slot number two um, let's just check so one oh i can hear friends down there already two and three right, so let's go ahead with number one um, I do apologise if it goes dark when I fire off these arrows, but um, it's a safe point here look for you. Get some booze. Uh, take, take it. Uh, part of the story I am. Is there something in the room? Oh, right, I did hear. I did hear friends. Right, I think. I think we have to go down here. Not 100% sure, but. We'll have a look anyway, shall we? Came in from that direction, so we'll keep heading down into the cave. Just be aware, we can, I'm pretty sure there's cannibals up ahead somewhere. Oh, damn, you bats! Yeah, there's some down there that. Um, oh, you've seen me already by the looks of it. Yeah, let's get the, um, Oh, I apologise if you can't see. 
<laughs> that one there is great, so I hit him. Alright, so they're down here. I'll tell you what we do. <laughs> Let's monitor them. Let's see how my. Uh... Oh, you'll be screaming in a minute. Oh. Oh. Don't come down there. Where, where are you going? Come on. I don't think I'm going to hit him. I'll tell you, I lost up my little friend, that's it. No! Alright. I, I can hit him with a flare gun, neither. Oh, they're beating each other up anyway. <laughs> oh, he's down! <laughs> he's beating his mate up. Let's have a dynamite, have some of this. Um, now there's a button that you can press. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I just dropped it. Boom! Let's see if he's. Oh, he's making noises. Oh, he did like that. Uh, let's get our bow out and go down. I think they're dead. Yeah, look. Blown into smithereens. <laughs> oh, it's probably not a good thing because I need all the bone armor I can get, but I just didn't want to die. So yeah, let's um. <laughs> Look at the state of them. <laughs> oh, well, there we go. Just despawned. All right. I'm not sure if I need to go left or right here. Uh, let's wait for these bones anyway. <clears throat> see if I have something to eat down here. A couple of snacks. Uh, make some more monitors. Uh, I think we can make another bomb as well. to make any more. There is a watch there. Come on, pal. Considering you've been dynamited. There we go. Oh, just make it go around if we got oh, 15 results. I can hear an auntie. Yeah, I think it's here. It says an auntie and baby. Yeah, this is where it is. We're in the right place. Okay, so to deal with auntie, we'll um, wherever the baby is. Uh, the babies are there. Look. Boom. There we go, we've got a couple of the babies. They're not nice babies, so... I don't feel sorry for them. And them babies, when they hit you, boy, they do some damage. Um, he can have... a Molotov. What's going on with this? I don't think I've hit one Molotov, have I? Have some arrows instead. Another baby just there, so we can hit that one. Yeah, got him. Another one there. Got it. So it's just arms that we need to deal with now. And he's a blue auntie, so he's um, he's a little bit stronger than the normal ones. Uh, now I think I 
Oh, whoa. Whoa. Let's grab the key card quickly. The camera there. Key card just there. Now. Whoa. Get out of his way. Give me my bow back. There we go. We've got a bit more room now. We can sort of straight. Right, I took a hit. Just keep firing this. Arrows into him. Try and get him in the head, Dave. Creepy armor now. There we are. Okay, that's arm to dealt with. So let's head out of the cave. We've got the key card. So now I think we're ready for little Timmy. Uh, let me just go through my checklist. Let's have a look. Key card. Uh, we've got a bow. We've got 23 arrows. 12 flares, we could do some more arrows and flares, I might head over to film crew camp while we're here, um, just to pick some of them up, but um, yeah, I'll see you guys when we get to our little trick spot, uh, ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba, we'll be the big reveal. Resistance here, guys. So, <laughs> you bugger. Let's see if we can get him in the head. Oh, God, how many is it? Oh. Let's just jump straight up. <laughs> Let's get up here. Uh, okay. yeah, here we go. What's he doing? Oh, you can. See if we can get some headshots. Yeah, yeah. Come here. Yeah. 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 Oh, he's a strong one, isn't he? I think she's run off by the looks of it. Oh, right in the nuts! <laughs> 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 Look at it. <laughs> oh, had it like that, huh, pal? <laughs> Do you 
you guys give up, or you're thirsty for more. Right, let's um, harvest the bones on these. No, not the bird. Oh my god. Oh, I'm not covered in blood. That was so close, eh? Oh, I thought I got that bird. That would have been it. My challenge would have been over. I would have been so annoyed. Oh. I think so he flew off safety. I don't think I did get him. But they keep coming back, look. So yeah, there's there's no dead bird here, so I think we're um, that was a close one, though. Right. There we are. That's what we're looking for. <coughs> You guys ready for the big reveal? The sinkhole, aka the butthole. Um, now, <clears throat> where we want to be is we go into the cave system. You can see the ledge there, look. Um, and inevitably, it brings you out at the bottom of the sinkhole. So, what we're going to do is we're going to bypass going through all the cave system because there'll be lots of enemies that we've got to attack. And, and what I'm going to do. Right in the middle of the sinkhole, there's like a little pond area. Um, I'm going to build a zip line across, and when I get about halfway, I'm going to detach from the zip line and I'm going to cross my fingers, my toes, and everything that I can cross and hope that I land in that water because um, that will just take you know so much time off of this, this challenge. So, um, yeah. There we go, guys. There's a big reveal. That's why I wanted the cloth, because to build the zip line, you're going to need about 14 ropes. Um, I've only got three at the moment. Um, so, seven cloth per rope. I'm going to need at least another 70 or 80 cloth. And I've got 156 there, so over the moon with that. Well happy. Um, I think this is as good a time as any to call this the end of the episode. In the next episode, episode four, we're going to be building the zip line. We're going to be heading down into the butthole. <laughs> Doesn't sound too good, does it? But yeah, we're going to be diving into the butthole. <laughs> oh dear. Um, so, <laughs> if you guys like the sound of that, um, join me in the next episode. And if you did like this video, um, please don't forget to hit that like button before you go. Hit the notification bell. It'll tell you every time I upload or if I go live. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I um, hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. But until then... Peace out.